Hey, this month's habitat tip it's pretty timely because in the news the last month has been an awful lot of discussion about monarch butterflies and monarch butterfly habitat. The federal government has recently introduced a new initiative for the U.S. Department of Agriculture and the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service in which they're going to go out and establish and improve monarch butterfly habitat. That's great, but you might be sitting at home saying, what can I do to make a difference? Well, today's habitat tip is going to talk about how you can acquire milkweed seed to go into your next habitat project. Because one of the things that we know for sure is that if we have no milkweed, we have no monarchs. You know, monarch butterfly populations are in the news an awful lot because over the last two decades, their populations have decreased by over 90%. Think about it, 90%. Well, that decrease is related primarily to two things. One, weather, which we can't control yet, and two, habitat, which we can control. Monarch species require a milkweed of the Asclepius genus to complete its life history. So the good news is there are lots and lots of milkweeds out there in North America but there's really only a handful that are commercially available in the Midwest and Great Plains to go into your next habitat project. So in today's tip, we're gonna talk about six of the most common milkweed species that you should think about for your next project. Our first species is butterfly milkweed. This is a tall grass prairie plant that's found in about three quarters of the United States for the most part an area with 25 to 30 inches of annual rainfall or more. It has a moderate cost and a beautiful orange flower that makes it highly attractive to both pollinators and gardeners. Next is swamp or rose milkweed. This plant is actually found in 43 of the lower 48 states of the country, so it's very widely distributed but it likes to find itself in areas where it can have moist feet. So a moist soil situation. It's a rather low cost seed and has a beautiful pink or rosy colored flower that is again attractive to both pollinators and gardeners. Next is world milkweed. This is a small short statured milkweed with very narrow leaves that is found in almost all the states east of the Rockies. This plant has a nice little delicate white flower and is short in stature, but high in the actual cost to obtain the seed. One of the more expensive milkweed species that you'll acquire. Showy milkweed is our milkweed species for the western half of the country. Its growth form and appearance is just like that of common milkweed. It has a moderate cost and will do well in our western or drier parts of the country. Sullivan's or smooth milkweed is a milkweed species that's pretty well restricted to the tall grass prairie region of the country. This species is actually considered to be threatened in some parts of the country. Its growth form and appearance looks an awful lot like common milkweed, but it's a very expensive milkweed species to acquire. Last but certainly not least is common milkweed, the workhorse of the milkweed world. It is found throughout much of the country, especially east of the Rocky Mountains. This species is an especially important one for monarch butterflies. In a recent study of monarch butterflies on their wintering grounds in Mexico, the study found that over 90% of those butterflies fed on common milkweed as a caterpillar. Common milkweed has many other strong points going for it when it comes to habitat projects as well. It's the lowest costing milkweed species that we can buy. It's easy to establish. It is adapted to a wide range of conditions. And if you've never stopped to smell the blossom, 
of a common milkweed in the month of July, I think it's the best smelling wildflower out there. Based on this summary of milkweed species available for the Midwest and Great Plains, I think it's clear that common milkweed is the species of choice for larger habitat projects. If you really want to benefit monarch butterflies with your habitat projects, you need to be including common milkweed in every single one of your seeding mixtures. All of these milkweed species and more of your habitat needs are available through Pheasants Forever. Give us a call at 844-SEED-NOW because whether you're working on a large habitat project of multiple acres and you want to have milkweed in it or you want to do something in your backyard in a small project, we can help. For your backyard, we can help you out with one of our new pollinator bears, a special mixture designed to create high quality pollinator habitat, or we can help line you up with just a few milkweed seeds. For more information about monarch butterflies and monarch butterfly habitat, check out our friends at Save Our Monarchs, the Monarch Joint Venture, and Monarch Watch, three great partners helping get better habitat on the landscape. Because creating any project that includes milkweeds, large or small, that's great habitat.